Get ready for jaw-dropping drama in Married at First Sight 2024. Brace yourselves as the cast includes a talented actress, a groundbreaking same-sex couple, a PR maven known for her unpredictability, and the show's oldest ever groom. Goodbye to wannabe influencers as the dating series takes an exciting turn. Don't miss the thrilling twists and turns that promise to make this season the most unforgettable yet. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. After watching these videos, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. EXCLUSIV Meet the Cast of Married at First Sight 2024, an actress, a same-sex couple, an unpredictable OPR maven and the oldest ever groom, as dating show shifts from a wannabe influencers the new season of Married at First Sight is right around the corner. Daily Mail Australia can now reveal the full list of brides and grooms set to walk down the aisle on the Channel 9 dating show this year. Season 11 will feature a diverse mix of participants who include an actress, influencer, PR maven, personal trainer, professional kickboxer and nutrition coach. It will also feature the show's oldest ever groom, a motivational speaker. Here are the faces set to make Married at First Sight Season 11 the most chaotic series to date. Lauren Dunn PR, Perth. Viewers won't be forgetting Lauren's name anytime soon. The Perth-based marketing and PR consultant will be one of the standout stars from this year's series. As previously revealed by Daily Mail Australia, the foodie delivered the drama at each of the dinner parties. There's more to her than big boobs and a foul mouth, a close friend dished. People assume that she's dumb and all looks, but she studied law and marketing at university. Lauren's personal life is just as spicy as her on-screen antics. Just months before the camera started rolling in July, she called it quits with Essendon AFL player Ryan Crowley, ending their five-year-long relationship. Tori Adams, Business Development Manager, Melbourne Tori is not your average business development manager, she embodies the perfect blend of outgoing charm and friendliness. But beware, once you cross into Tori's bad side, things are bound to get heated. Tip to become a fan favorite, Tori has earned her reputation as one of the most loyal souls you'll ever encounter. Sarah Mesa, 29, Nutritionist, Sydney Sydney-based Sarah is a force not to be reckoned with. At just 29, this nutrition coach, who works at the celebrity hotspot Acero and runs her own business The Fit and Hungry Girls, is another name viewers won't be able to forget anytime soon. Known for her unwavering determination, this outspoken dynamo knows exactly what she wants when it comes to matters of the heart. No stranger to hard work, a close friend spilled the beans to Daily Mail Australia, revealing, she's a very hard-working girl who's had her share of bad luck in the love department. Eden Harper, 28, Recruitment Consultant, Gold Coast Gold Coast-based Eden is another tip to be watched this year. The 28-year-old recruitment consultant, who already boats 12,000 Instagram followers and loves a selfie, will surprise viewers. Eden will take audiences on a journey that will test friendships and her own relationship, a source close to production told Daily Mail Australia. Eden was approached to apply via Instagram and finally agreed to do it after a number of weeks of convincing. Ellie Dix Dash, Cosmetic Nurse Injector, Gold Coast Gold Coast-based registered nurse Ellie is also set to appear on the show. There will be another bride that will take viewers on a journey as they fall in love with her gorgeous nature. Sources close to production have let slip that the glamorous brunette will be another main player. They describe her as social and bubbly and she is excited to meet the one. Lucinda Light, MC and wedding celebrant, NSW. Byron Bay marriage celebrant and MC Lucinda is unlike anything viewers have seen before. With a theatrical arts training background, Lucinda is a natural-born front woman and will deliver plenty of laughs. Lucinda's presence is authentic, magnetic, playful yet classy. 
she is skillfully in tune with the mood of the crowd and has a knack for ensuring everyone feels warmly welcomed. Andrea Thompson Dash, Wedding Photographer, Brisbane Andrea is fun, caring and is on the hunt to find love again after spending the past few years focusing on her job. The Brisbane-based bride works as a professional wedding photographer and has over-experience up her sleeve. Despite being the oldest bride to appear on the series, Andrea has no problem standing up for what she believes in. Natalie Parham, 32, Physio, Melbourne Melbourne-based physiotherapist Natalie will be unlike any bride we've ever met before. The 32-year-old is tipped to bring a touch of humor and humanity to the series. A trailer for the much-anticipated series sees Natalie sprain her ankle while arriving at her wedding. Cassandra Allen, Influencer, Gold Coast Stunning micro-influencer of African descent, Cassandra Allen, who hails from the Gold Coast, will add some extra glamour to the much-anticipated series. She already boasts 10,200 followers on Instagram. Photos shared to her Instagram page show her flaunting her influencer lifestyle. Cass is known for her love of laughter, sunshine, and the simple joys of life, elements that she eagerly shares with her followers. Close pals of the influencer were not surprised by her decision to join the show, with one telling Daily Mail Australia, Cass has been telling her friends that she would end up on MAFS for years. This is literally her dream becoming true, they added. Jade Powell, Model, Gold Coast South African bombshell Jade will be one of two intruder brides set to bring a whole lot of drama to the series. But she's not just your average mum next door as sources close to the brunette bombshell have told Daily Mail Australia that the bride isn't one to hold back what she is thinking. According to friends she has a very infectious personality and isn't afraid to get her hands dirty. Maddie Jevick, actress, Melbourne. Home and Away star Maddie Jevick will be making an appearance on the series. Maddie is best known for playing Amber Simmons on the long-running Channel 7 soap. As previously revealed by Daily Mail Australia, fellow cast members were convinced Maddie was a mold planted by production in order to shake things up. One spy told Daily Mail Australia that alarm bells were ringing when she told everyone she was a psychic or a medium rather than actress. Jaden Inod, 26, professional kickboxer, Gold Coast. Gold Coast-based Jaden, the younger brother of Mitch who appeared on season 9 in 2022, will be following in his siblings' footsteps. The professional kickboxer, 26, isn't afraid of confrontation and will stand by his views no matter how outrageous they seem. He will deliver plenty of laughs and drama at the dinner parties. Jaden's wedding was attended by his brother Mitch, who was paired with Ella Ding. Ben Walters, tour director, Newcastle. Newcastle-based tour director Ben Walters has swapped his travel maps for the camera. A seasoned traveler, Ben boasts a following of 4,823 on TikTok and has garnered over 61,200 likes for his engaging and hilarious videos. Ben will be one of the many grooms set to receive a grilling by the experts on the couch. Jonathan, Jono and McCullough, 39, Managing Director, Brisbane. Brisbane-based Jono is a managing director and is looking for love after years of being single. Jono, 39, has been described as a nice guy and will be one of the featured grooms in this year's chaotic season. His patience will certainly be tested. McCullough spent over a decade working as a financial advisor before he decided to start his own health food store, Boy of Vital, where he sells powerful health supplements. He's also served for years in the army as an infantry soldier. Tim Cowell, e-commerce marketing, Gold Coast. Tim studied civil engineering at university before switching into marketing. He now runs his own e-commerce digital marketing company and specializes in profitable revenue generation. He is down to earth and a lot of fun, a friend told Daily Mail Australia. Tim is one of eight participants from the Gold Coast to appear on the dating show this year. 
Jack Dunkley, 34, personal trainer, Gold Coast. Jack will no doubt set pulses racing thanks to his chiseled six-pack and muscular frame. But it won't be all sunshine and roses for this Gold Coast personal trainer as he embarks on a journey for love on television. Jack's past relationships are set to resurface, creating a storm of drama that will leave fans on the edge of their seats. Daily Mail Australia can reveal that Jack will soon find himself in hot water thanks to a few eyebrow-raising comments. Timothy Smith, Real Estate, Melbourne Prepare yourselves for the magnetic force that is Timothy, the enigmatic real estate tycoon and gin distillery owner hailing from Melbourne. He's not your average guy, and his journey on MAFS is bound to leave an indelible mark on viewers. Behind his tough exterior lies a heart of gold that will strike a chord with audiences everywhere. Timothy is the friend we all wish we had unapologetically outspoken, hilariously funny, and never one to shy away from speaking his mind, no matter how unpopular his opinions may be. Rumor has it that Timothy has formed a tight-knit, family-like bond with his fellow grooms. But, beware to those who dare cross his path, Timothy doesn't back down easily. With over a decade of real estate expertise under his belt, Timothy's decision to join MAFS is nothing short of a bold move. Richard Sourman, Motivational Speaker, Sydney Meet Richard, the 62-year-old South African sensation on a quest for love. With an impressive 35-year career in advertising, Richard, known as the brand guy, becomes the show's oldest groom, bringing wisdom and confidence to the romantic battlefield. As a motivational speaker and father of three, he navigates the challenges of letting his guard down and rediscovering love, all while balancing his professional and personal life. Richard's annual inclusion in the global top 30 brand gurus since 2014 adds an extra layer of prestige to his impressive resume. Tristan Black, 29, Entertainment Manager, Sydney Northern Beaches-based Tristan Black is also looking for love. Friends describe the entertainment manager as a very down-to-earth type of guy, who is it as genuine as they come once you break down the wall. Tristan will take viewers on a journey as he finds himself while trying to navigate his marriage. Collins Christian, State Government, Perth Collins is a super funny, really nice guy who has been trying to get on MAFS for years, according to one friend. He has a really good sense of humor, they added. He enjoys spending time with family, friends and loves a good pint at the pub on a Sunday afternoon. Rich Barreto, Professional Weightlifter, Sydney This won't be professional weightlifter Ridge's first stint on a reality show. Ridge, who claims he isn't vanilla, previously appeared on first dates back in 2020. He also competed at the Commonwealth Games in both 2018 on the Gold Coast and 2022 in Birmingham where he finished in fifth place. Michael Felix, Car Salesman, Melbourne Michael, known to his friends as Mike, will add much-needed diversity when he enters the show as the first gay groom since season 3. The American-born car salesman has spent the past three years working for Tesla after working at Gold's Gym and Fitness first in Melbourne. Friends describe him as a super funny and charming guy who is on the hunt for the one after being scared off dating apps. He is very well liked in our group. I really hope MAFS doesn't break his spirits. Stephen Stewart, Hairdresser, Perth Perth-based hairdresser Stephen is also on the hunt to find a partner on the show. As previously revealed by Daily Mail Australia, Stephen was brought in as a last-minute replacement after Michael's original groom pulled out of the show after attending the Bucks night. Ash Galati, Pest Control, Melbourne Former builder Ash is set to enter the experiment as an intruder. The tattooed hunk has been described as a super nice guy who has bad luck in the love department. Despite Channel 9 bosses revealing that the forthcoming series will be less screechy and focus more on love, Daily Mail Australia can reveal that things on set have been the most chaotic to date. Thanks for watching this videos. 
please hit the subscribe button for more updated news.